Hey guys, I'm back. Uh, this video, uh, this is one of my first cases of pre-recorded videos, so normally when I do a video, I record it in like 10-15 minutes and then upload it immediately after. Uh, this video can't do that. I'm currently recording this on Super Bowl Sunday. Uh, it's February 3rd. Um, this video is going to be posted, uh, I think, probably February 14th or 15th, someday after Valentine's Day. Uh, and you'll see, uh, mainly because two of the figures in this video were made for a gift for, uh, uh, a friend's, uh, significant other, uh, so he won't, as a gift for Valentine's Day, so this won't be posted until after that, so she's, it's a surprise, so I can't post it yet, so now, hopefully by now she's seen them, so I can post this now, but, um, for now, have some, uh, updates and new figures to show, it's another various figures, uh, part, whatever number it is, I don't know, I didn't even look this time. What's new, never do. Uh, what I can give, let Lego like Wolf make a, a joke out of it. Um, so, three new figures, two updates. I'll start with the update. Uh, one, I don't think I ever showed this updated face. This is my Arthur Morgan. Uh, you've seen this a couple times now. I made this new face. Um, so, I ditched the chops and I made this like bearded head. Um, not sure if I showed this yet or not, but that's what he looks like. Oh, there we go. So it's just a bearded head, and technically it's a new hat as well. Um, hat hair combo, you know, comes off with it. So and so that's the face. It was a uh, one of those clone heads for base, and rubbed off the uh, the mouth and the eyebrows and painted my own but uh... that is pretty much it for all that that's changed so just the overall better looking head for Arthur here and uh... Maybe I still have him with the mutton chops in the game but this looks nicer for a figure um... next uh... the only other updates this big boy uh... so this is i've decided this is my favorite thing i've ever made this Optimus prime uh... my last video was on him uh, changes I've made. Uh, I've added some more detail to them. Uh, some clips of the movie came out, making it easier for reference. So there's some detail on the inside of the arm now. Um, most of the changes. Uh, I've added some some bits on the neck there. Not much. Uh, the chest and legs. Those all remain the same. What's changed is on the back here. So you remember the back last time? There was like nothing on there. I've added these panels on the back on both sides and painted those, painted the back, added those panels, added these circular bits, painted all these other details, added these boxes to the back that are like on the front, um, put these tubes in there, just overall added some more detail to the back of it because it's still not 100% accurate if at all but it's much more accurate than it was and I'm fine with it so but yeah so this uh it for this Optimus, my favorite thing I've ever made, this Optimus right here. Love it. Um Optimus Prime's probably my favorite fictional character of all time, so no surprise that I like that so much. Uh so now for the new figures. Uh here's John Wick. So, you know, John Wick 3 trailer came out. Also rewatched the first John Wick with my dad, uh, which got me in a mood, so I made this really quick John Wick figure. Head is um same base head as the Arthur Morgan head. It's one of the angry clone heads with everything erased but the eyes and the cheekbones. Painted on the facial hair, painted on some mouth wrinkles. Uh, painted on the scars. Uh, this is all 100% painted. Painted the vest, the dark blue shirt with the tie. The dark blue is on the wrist as well. Uh, I don't think there's anything on the back. No, just black. Got a brick arms gun, and uh, that is pretty much it for John Wick. So, pretty simple. I think it looks pretty good for a quick figure I made, like maybe an hour. So, and then uh, so here's the two. These two are a pair. So here's the two figures that um, the surprise figures that hopefully she's seen by now. So I won't be posting this until I have confirmation she's seen them, but. Um, they're from Over the Garden Wall, I think this is, uh, fair warning, I know nothing about this show, I just know the name and the characters' names, got no clue anything else about this show, except for, I've seen the Highwayman bit, um, so I think this is Wirt and this is Greg, um, so, 
these are the two little duders from over the garden wall it's an animated thing um, so Wirt here modded Mutt Williams hair to get the little point in the middle um, actually same head as John Wick and Arthur Morgan an angry clone head with everything removed but the eyes painted a mouth, painted his little triangle nose, his little eyebrows sculpted his little cone hat made this cloak um, painted his shoes and socks, his little buttons and his high pants with inside of the cloak is red to match the hat and the little gold buttons around the back just cloak but uh, that's really it with him and then here's Greg um, he's a little short guy, he's got a little round nose same side mouth, so this character actually has no eyebrows at all so didn't paint him I stuck with Lego eyes as well just because they look not Lego eyes on Lego figures usually look creepy um, little tea little tea kettle sculpted maybe turn it upside down that's supposed to be like that I painted the little or sculpted the little frog that um, I don't know if this frog has a name or not but I know it sits on top of that tea kettle um, and pictures I found so I sculpted him sitting up there if it would focus on him yeah so he just sits up there uh, again don't know if that frog has a name or not if he does no clue uh, he's made him uh, fat as well as dude's little chubby cut off the neck peg for that as well uh, his front looks like an ass um, that's just how the character looks if you look up a picture of him so um, there's the back the little suspenders as well are electrical tape uh, so his little strap around him he's got his little tie painted and uh, his little shoes so coolest part about him is his little kettle and the frog so but that is pretty much it for this video so uh, over the garden wall Wart and Greg and then Arthur Morgan and John Wick here uh, Arthur Morgan's rifle always falls and that annoys me. Get John Wick in here and then um I'll slide out the mess back here just so you can see him. But uh that's pretty much it for this video. So uh thank you guys for watching. Uh let me know what you think down below. Uh you know, and as usual videos will come when there are videos to post, so thank you for watching, and uh, have a good one.